Hi y'all, it's Dan for Numerical Lion coming to you from a secret undisclosed location to talk about this secret ancient occult practice of gematria, this coding of numbers into letters and letters into numbers. And this is another story that I saw today on January 10th Another murder by number story. Harry Haynes, American Horror Story actor, dead at age 27. Right? And for those that aren't familiar with Murder by Numbers, check out the movie Murder by Numbers with Sandra Bullock, where the E, the movie poster, the E looks like a three backwards in the B definitely looks like an 8, like 38, like murder equals 38. This is a number we see often, also 83. Also, Haynes equals 51, which is interesting because the story is given to us on a day with 51 numerology. 1 plus 10 is 11, plus 20 is 31, plus 31, 31 plus 20 is 51. So, so let's read what they have to say. Actor Harry Haynes, who played roles in titles including American Horror Story, has died, age 27. His mother, Jane Badler, has announced. Badler, who herself has starred in both the 1980s original and 2009 remake of science fiction drama V, said on Instagram that her son died on January 7th. On January 7th, my beautiful son died. He was 27 and had the world at his feet, but sadly he struggled with mental illness and addiction, she wrote. There's so a picture of him with long hair. And... Notice that the ceremony is going to be held on Sunday, January 12th. And January 12th can be written 12 slash 1 in most of the world, like 121. It's a blood sacrifice number. I'll show you why that's relevant later on. Oops, what did I do? Now I'm on Instagram for some reason. Um, So he was a brilliant spark, shone bright too short a time. I will miss you, Harry, every day of my life. Haynes was in one episode of the American Horror Story and has also had parts in TV series Sneaky Pete and the OA. He played prominent roles in independent movies and starred in the 2015 drama The Surface. So, lots to decode here. First of all, the OA equals 86, and 22 is an important number, and blood sacrifice equals 86. Also 121, the funerals being held on 1 slash 12 or 12 slash 1. No coincidence there. And the other one's called Sneaky Pete. The other thing he was involved with, Sneaky Pete 121, like Blood Sacrifice, also 149. That's an interesting number, and I'll show you why. And also, this is interesting because he suffered from mental illness. What was the other one? Addiction. Mental illness. Oh, it's addiction is the one. Addiction. I mean, virtually the same numbers as the surface. See that? Addiction, 43. The surface, 43. Addiction, 164. The surface, 164. Also, 56. So let's get to the decode. He was born on December 4th in Melbourne, Australia. Died in Los Angeles, California. So another one for the 27 club, right? Ritual number 27. 
He died 20, with 27 days left in the year. December 4th has 27 days left in the year. How appropriate that he should die at age 27. From his birthday to his death was 34 days. And his first name, Harry, equals 34. And murder equals 34. So he died on the 35th day of his age, December 4th to January 7th. If you include the end day, that's what they call it, the 35th day of his age of being 27. Harry Haynes equals 149. Remember we saw that number before with one of the shows he's on, Sneaky Pete, also 149. What's so special about 149? It's the 35th prime number. And that's how many days it was apart from his birthday. 35 days. Another blood sacrifice for the cabal. Look at Harry Haynes, 121. Blood sacrifice, 121, also 67. And remember, the funeral is being held on 12 slash 1 or 1 slash 12. Right, and we also had one of the shows he was on, Sneaky Pete, as one to one as well. So he was on American Horror Story that equals one eighteen. And 118, he died in the land of 118. Los Angeles, California equals 118. And death in Jewish equals 118. So he struggled with mental with addiction and mental illness. Look at that. Addiction 79, mental illness 79. And of course these are murder numbers. Addiction 79. Mental illness 79, just in case you can't see that. And murder 79. You know, that's that's why she mentioned addiction and mental illness. So he was born with 137 numerology. You see this number a lot. 12 plus 4 plus 19 plus 92 is 137. It's the 33rd prime number. We go here in number properties 137 the 33rd prime number and that's significant because his last name Haynes equals 33 and also Harry Haynes or HH equals 38 in reverse another murder number he was born with 16 numerology as well. 12 plus 4 is 16. All right, 38, murder, death, killing, 38. Also, it was four weeks and six days after his birthday. It's a sacrifice number. Sacrifice equals 46, right? And looking at this further, he died on the, on the seventh day, leaving 359 left. 359, if you go to this incredible tool, 359 is the 76 second prime number. And he's from Melbourne, Australia, which equals 72. And 72 is the reflection of 27, right? He died at age 27. He died with 27 days left in the year. And it also makes me think of the 72 names of God. So in addition to the many names of God of Israel revealed in the Torah, the Jewish mystical tradition coined some other names of God, primarily for use in the study of Kabbalah, 
in Kabbalistic meditation. Many of these mystical names were derived from the scriptures using methodologies developed in ancient Babylonia. So the Jewish mystical tradition had two primary groups that were interested in esoteric meanings of the Hebrew names of God. The theoretical Kabbalists meditated on the names of God for spiritual insight. Often this took the the form of studying permutations of the divine names to gain esoteric knowledge about God. This is a form of Gnosticism or Theosophy. Practical Kabbalists attempted to use the names of God to magically affect the physical and supernatural worlds. Often this took the form of inscribing the names on protective amulets and other artifacts. This is, the, this is a form of occultism that is plainly condemned in the Torah. So, that's a little bit about the 72 names of God. In 72, the reflection uh, of 27. I'm just going to look up her name, Jane Badler. Jane, 30, just like Haynes. Jane Badler, 72. We were just talking about 72, right? The reflection of 27. The 72 names of God. Had her kid in Melbourne, Australia. Badler, 42. You know, Australia. Also 39. Um, Australia, 30. And then with the 39... And Melbourne, 42. She had the kid in Melbourne. The kid, or his name is Melbourne, 42. He was born with 48 numerology, too. So, rest in peace to this man. I never knew him. <clears throat> I'm not too up to date with pop culture, but I'm not at all up to date with pop culture. But, you know, another person dead by the code, the code of numbers and letters. He was born with 48 numerology. Thanks so much for your support. Please um, like my channel. Check out the others in the truth community, like Simple Truth TV like Zachary K. Hubbard, learn this code, get acquainted with this ancient knowledge.